so I got my hairstylist to do my hair because usually when you go back to school, well, I'm not going to talk for y'all, but I'm going to talk for me. And when I go back to school, I do not like to do my hair for at least like a week or a month or so. So I would either get braids or I would just get like a weed because I'm thinking about like college going back to school in my head. I would just get like a weed or a wig or something. So I got her to install this wig for me, but as you can see, like right here, it's coming up in some places. So I'm just gonna use my pump it up spray so that I can lay it back down. But she also did like the braid in for me. She cornrowed my hair and she just did all that good stuff so it can like stay and last longer. Now I already know how to put back on a wig, but the fact that she installed it and made it look better than what I do. It just made it easier for me to upkeep and then I can go back to her and get maintenance on my front tool. So yeah, one thing about going back to school that I always look at is making it easy for me in the morning. And curly hair makes it so easy for you to just grab you some water, spray, spray, spray spray maybe put some you know curling cream in it and go and then if you need to touch up your uh frontal like i am then just use some pump it up spray or use like the got to be glue um that clear one the black one use that put it down tie your scarf on so that's exactly what i'm gonna do so what i'm gonna do is put some pump it up on it and just go just like this Okay, and then just like smush it down on my head. And then also, where's my brush? See, so yeah, I'm gonna take my brush and just press down right here. So now what I like to do is take some powder and just touch up the roots so I can look more skin-like. Cause my scalp is like really, really pale. Like it looks just like this. I feel a piece of hair, I do not see it. Where is it? Oh, there it is. <laughs> okay, so now I'm going to take my scarf and I'm just going to lay my hair down in the front. Alright, so now we just have to work on this hair real quick. And this ain't going to take but a second. So I just have my Curl Keeper spray bottle here. This is a H2O uh, water bottle. It's by, I think it's H2O, it's called H2O. But I just know it's like the Curl Keeper water bottle and it looks like this. And the reason why this drink is so nice is because when you like press down once, it keeps spraying for like at least like two or three seconds. So like, I'm spraying it down. You see, like it just stays consistent and just goes. Just so easy. So I'm just gonna go ahead and spray my whole head, get a little wet, and then run through it with some smoothing cream. Cause I am a hard sleeper. When I sleep, I'm sleep. Don't mess with me. I actually wanna take this T-Gen Buttercream Deli Moisturizer, and I just wanna put a little bit, like just the slightest amount on my hand, that's it. And I'm just gonna run it through my hair. So it can like help control some of the frizz throughout the day. I took a little bit more for this side because that side just soaked it right on up. So I already added a moisturizer, but I'm gonna use this too because I just love this stuff. It controls oils on my skin. I don't know how it does that. And it just has like a lot of good benefits about it. 
Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna add this to my skin. My face feels really smooth right now too, but I'm just gonna add this baby to my skin all over. So I'm just taking my concealer and I'm just gonna like spot conceal everywhere. Cause like I said, I got some pimples right here. I need to go away. I'm just gonna add some to my eyes, under my eyes and around my nose because I have like redness around my nose. So now I'm just gonna take my hand for real and just work that in. Cause when you, you know, on the go, you don't got time to use a brush. You don't got time to be clean as sponges if it's not clean. So just take your hand and go to town. And this is honestly your best instrument for real. So my skin is kind of like glass. That's the only way I can give you guys a picture of how my skin is. But I mean, you can see it too. Like you can see, I don't know if you can see like the little veins in my skin, but I really don't want that to show. So I'm just taking the leftover concealer on my hand and I'm just working that into my face. So now I'm just taking a little bit of powder and I'm gonna put this right under my eye. I'm not really setting it. But I'm setting it so it doesn't like crease throughout the day. And I'm gonna just set my nose a little bit and my forehead. So you know I have to, like it is a must for me to do my brows. So that is what I'm about to do now. I'm using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow and I'm just gonna, you know, fill my brows in. Not even a little bit, a lot. I'm gonna fill them joints in. All right, so now I wanna look a little glowy. So I'm gonna take this Wet n Wild Hello Halo Liquid Highlighter and I'm gonna put some, I'm gonna take some on my finger cause this stuff is a little potent. And I'm just gonna put this on the high points of my cheeks. And just glow. Oh, and I'm gonna take some on my eyebrow bone. Yeah, so I just wanna glue. Guess who's here? Yo, 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 yo. You like my highlight? Why is it on your eyeball? I'm gonna blend it. Oh, 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 oh yeah. I haven't blended it yet. Look at sweet though. You want some Twix assists? Snicker bars, this is Milky Ways, this is this is this for one dollar. If y'all ain't see that video, go watch that jump. All right, so now I'm taking this Becca. This is the Aprice Glow Kit. I it's not even a glow kit because it's not ABH, but this is the Becca Aprice um Ski Glow. And I'm gonna take this like golden shade right here and this one down here and just highlight a little bit more. Okay, so I'm gonna take this black eyeliner and I'm gonna um, line my eyes with this. All right, so I'm gonna take this CoverGirl Lash Amplify Primer because I feel like it is making my eyelashes grow. So I'm just gonna put this on first and then I'm gonna put this Voluminous Butterfly Mascara on. This is a waterproof one because my eyes be turned up throughout the day sometimes. And I don't want my mascara to run because that just looks crazy. So now I'm just gonna create some freckles on my face. Like not even freckles, just like beauty marks. So I'm just taking my dip brow and this is in medium brown. And I'm going to, I need to look at the mirror. Hold on. All right, I'm going to just create one right here because this is a little pimple. I'm gonna take the little bit and squeeze as much lip gloss out of here as I can, but this is my Bath and Body lip gloss. I need to get some more, like, today. 
But yeah, I'm just gonna push this out and put some gloss on. Now I'm going to spray my face with this Hangover RX 3-in-1 Replenishing Spray and then I'm gonna use the CoverGirl Look Lockup. All right, y'all, so that is the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it useful, helpful, and hopefully inspiring. If you did like this video, definitely like down below. Hit that thumbs up button. Comment down below what you want to see next. Also, if you're not following me on my Instagram, definitely do that. All right, and I think that is it. I love you guys so much. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not already subscribed to this channel. And go ahead and watch my other videos. I love you guys so freaking much, and I will see you in my next video. Bye. I think like my shoulder, is something wrong with my shoulder. No sis, I can't. Bye.